you see your energy program, your energy inventions, yeah, as the solution to the scandal. Yeah, absolutely. It is a solution, and it is a solution that has uh, uh, severe future consequences, positive consequences. You know, there is actually, believe me, to the best of my knowledge, I cannot tell you any of such disadvantages that we now experience, for example, with burning our coal or oil and the fuel, you know, we have not to do this. And only this fact, this must attract people and this must show people here is a realistic solution and we can always improve a solution, but we have to start also with this solution. So do you find yourself getting quite angry? No, I'm not angry because, you know, I know uh, most people are stupid and uh, we have to live with stupid people in the stupid world, you know. If you look to many of these things that you can see in the newspapers or in TV, you know, you can get angry like hell, you know, about these things. And uh, But it will not change. You can only uh, do your best, you know, to convince people there is a solid solution and let us go forward with this. I will go forward even if any, everybody says I am crazy. Of course, then they can tell I am crazy. <laughs> I am more than willing to accept this because I know I am right. And sooner or later the time will come. And believe me, a lot of my uh, correspondence that I sent out, I sent to the President of the United States, I sent to Mrs. Merkel in Germany, I sent to all the high-ranking politicians, to the administration and so forth. And I do it on purpose. I do it on purpose because this is a correspondence that will stay there forever. And these documents, they can show future generations who was stupid, who was not listening. And you know, as long as people are not listening, we will not create a better world. We have at first to listen, we have to learn, to understand, make our own judgments. This is the way it works, and not the other way. We cannot live uh, that we always say, okay, let us hope, that let us pray. This does not work, you know. You can go to church as many times as you like. Excuse me if I say this, but if you are a bad person and you have not a good heart, it will not matter, you know. It will not help the world. Therefore, you have actually to do your own best, what you think is appropriate, and at least I think what is in the mind of someone who is up there and who likes that what he created is surviving. This way, how we right now do it with our energy, we are not surviving. This is a fact. And if anybody says this is not a fact and we have no global warming, we have no pollution, then I'm sorry, that, and I feel very sorry for him because he apparently does not read, does, is uneducated, and is not willing to listen.